Hey guys, it's Cassie. Welcome to my channel if you're new. Welcome back if you're a seasoned subscriber. Today we're going to be talking about my updated luxury wish list for this year. We've had some changes, okay? We've moved on. I did this um, at the beginning of the year and you know what? Times have changed. I've let go of some of those items. Uh, naturally more have added the, their way onto the list. <laughs> guys, if you are new here, my name is Cassie. I'm a self-diagnosed luxury addict. I put out videos on Wednesdays and Fridays. So if you like luxury fashion, then you're probably gonna like those too. So head down there, click the red button, subscribe, turn on the notification bell, become a member of our luxury addicted family. When are we going to rehab? Never. Guys, are you ready? Let's go. Starting off with the Fendi Baguette in the classic Zucker print with a neon green trim. Now, listen, listen, we know I love a neon pop, okay? I am here for it. I'm here for slime green, acid green, lime green, uh, neon yellow, whatever you wanna call it, I love it. It is so me, okay? Because we have, we have the classic print, and you know me, I'm a logo ho, okay? I don't mind having something that says the name all over it. I'm not bothered. If you think it's tacky, cool. I'm a tacky bitch. I love it, okay? I spent money on it. You're about to see that I spent money on it. So this bag, really, there's no, there's no thinking it's not Fendi. And then the neon trim just was like, what a moment, what a moment for me. So the next item on my wish list are the Louboutin Aurelian sneakers. It is a very specific one. The one with the leopard print pony hair. Do we not just picture me with these trainers, okay? Now listen, when I was in the Louboutin shop and I tried on the gold versions, the woman was like, oh, they're inspired by Jordans, blah, blah, blah. And I know people in the comments might be like, they just look like Jordans. And fair enough, fair enough if they look like Jordans, but this is gonna be awful, but do they have a red bottom and do the Jordans come in leopard print pony hair? No, 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 I don't think they do. So there we go, that's where I want the issues. I love the style. I think that it is a classic, very street style looking design. Goes great with jeans, would be great for the later months in the year as well as the summer, but I feel like she's more of an autumn winter shoe if you get what I mean. The third item on the list are a pair of Amina Muadi shoes, yes. Yes! Again, mentioned these shoes in my Hottie Shoes of 2019. Now listen to me. I love, I believe they're called the Gilda in the rainbow, okay? So the body of the shoe is like a, a metallic green, okay? And we already know my obsession with lime green at the moment. She's almost a lime green. And then the straps across the front of the shoe are in rainbow crystals. There are three straps, two across the front and one at the ankle. I die, I need them. I think that they are the pièce de résistance to set off an outfit. Okay, so the next item is very much, I feel, a staple, hence I need it. I think I need an acne bomber jacket. Do we not agree? I feel like, I feel like I would, it's just an essential that I need to, ch to check off my list. The classic black, bomber jacket, a little bit oversized, you know. I want it to be like my go-to um, autumn winter jacket, you know? I feel like bomber jackets are just, just there to top it off. Do you wanna know what else bomber jackets look great with? Denim shorts. You know, as the evenings cool down in the summer months, so you could still go, oh, it's still cool and cute enough for a denim short, but I'm just gonna top it off with a bomber jacket draped over my shoulders. And I feel like if you're gonna get a bomber jacket, get an acne bomber jacket, okay? You're gonna be shocked because you know how I love a medium to small bag at the moment. I feel like I need to have a go-to travel bag. And by travel bag, I mean even when, like I am taking the train to go and see my parents on a weekend. You know, this bag is great for just throwing and go. And that is the YSL Reeve Gauche like tote bag. It's a decent price. It's canvas, leather handles. And I feel like she is just ticking all of the boxes. She's a wonderful travel on. Throw everything in and get on with your life. I love her, hence she's on the list. The last item on my luxury wish list at the moment. Listen, a while ago I did a video called Most Popular Bags I Would Never Buy. And I think this bag was like the first one on the list. And I now want to be a Birkin mother. Ever since my mum got a Birkin, I want one. I have seen her in her element 
popping, making a moment, just like oozing, oozing that like elegance. I want a 30. I want a like a togo leather. I want a blues or greens. I, I'm ready to jump on the bandwagon. I'm ready to jump on the bandwagon. I'm ready to weasel my way into getting a Birkin. Gold hardware, gold hardware. <laughs> Look at me, of course it's gonna be gold hardware. Let me know what is on your wish list, okay? Because these things change. Guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please like it. Subscribe if you haven't already, come and join us. Have an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening wherever you are, and I will see you in my next video. Mwah. Bye guys.